I actually don't remember if I watched this one before. Kyla almost debuted as indie VTubers before she joined Hololife, and this one is by Ninja Zombie Channel. If I didn't watch this one before, yeah, we can watch it right now, but if we did watch it before, then let's watch it again. Mm, next one is I wanna talk about finally I can share about how I did my audition. I've never really talked about this before because I'm keeping it for the 777k actually. Oh, I think I remember this one. I already. wanna talk but about I my audition. I wanna about. share my experience about that. Yeah, so at first I dubbed myself so much. I have a lot of anxieties, doubts to myself about I don't know back then. Back then I was so confused about what to do in my life. I know that I don't really have that many many friends, but you do know that I have like um, my group of friends that coming from school, right? They're all uh -huh. very successful pretty much. Uh, and then I can see that um, they already know what they wanna do in their lives. And then there was Kyla that's still wandering around. I mean, I have a good job. I have a good income actually back then. I live my life just like normal. It's normal. It's like office work, right? Office work that just love playing games so much. And then I felt like this is not what I want. Actually, I know what I want, but I just feel like it's so far. Even dreaming about it, I'm scared. I put my dreams aside because I'm. Too I feel like scared. that's relatable for I'm a lot of people. I'm too scared to try. Just like I just like yeah, the same thing. It's just like you're too scared to try to achieve your dreams because you know, or maybe you think that it is not possible. There has just been so many like, how, how should I say this? Discouragement for some people like parents, teachers, friends, literally everyone around you. Just like. They don't believe you can do it because before you actually succeeded, you are just an ordinary person. Like, there's nothing to trust in you. No, Kyla, shut up. Stop thinking about the other thing. Just go on with whatever you have now. Just be grateful. Put it aside. It's so okay. funny because I literally actually saw the the Holoro audition back then. And I was like thinking about it. But no, Kyla. Stop thinking about that. This is just something that you want, but maybe it's not something that you need. I just put that aside. I close whatever information that I got that time. And then it passed, right? And then it passed. Several months passed from the... After the second gen audition. I was like... I always have this kind of thoughts that I really really want to have like other kinds of jobs not the 9 to 5 jobs every single day because I feel like this is not me this but I'm too afraid I'm too confused about what can I do and then even though like thinking about like being a streamer or like something an early like that midlife Mama crisis Alice kind of always thing. say something like I know that there are plenty of successful streamers out there but are you sure you have like somewhat like a future, like a good future ahead? I agree with Mama Ella in Mama Ella's point of view too, right? Um, being in the office job that I had previously, I literally have a good path, career path already. The future is clear. If I'm being like a part-time streamer together with me doing the office job, my office, I, I cannot even focus on my office job. I'm too afraid if my my other ego gonna consume me and gonna ruin everything, gonna mess my whole life up. Being like a streamer, it gonna use all of your um, brain energy because it forced you to be creative. Yeah, so mm. after that, I never really told anyone about what I wanna try. It's so scary. So that time, I watch enough Holo Life lah. I watch a lot, right? I watch a mm -hmm. lot of Holo Life. Yeah. And then I know that there are things about VTubers. And then I'm trying to research it. Thinking about joining Holo Life is still not my option. Too scary it's too scary who am i 
the first main reason why I want to be VTuber is actually because no one gonna knows me. No one in the real life gonna judge me because even if I Ooh. fail in my VTuber game. Oh gosh, journey, why is Kyla so negative? The reason why she want to become VTuber is just to hide herself so that nobody can judge her. Be more confident, man. No one in my real life circle gonna judge me for that. They will not laugh over it. I feel like Okay, this is the best thing because if I'm a streamer, if I fail, people gonna know, right? So if I fail, I fail. And then after that, I started to do the crazy step. The first step, I did a commission about like a VTuber commission. The funny thing is, I literally planned, I did the commission of the L2D model, I do the I, I do the rigging commissions and then I spent like almost all of my savings. I spent almost all of my savings back then for that. Then I was like so ready. I I I I did commissions for like the emotes and everything and then I'm I was like so ready ready, you know? Mm -hmm. You really went all it. Yeah. I I was like planning all of my debut thingy. I commissioned like the lore video, the the emotes, um then all of it. I already set a date of the debut, right? The debut streak. And then yeah, that's that's just for my like it's a go big or go home. And then I told myself that if I failed it's for a good cause. I say to myself, if I failed this, fine. I'm gonna be the office worker all of my life. It's okay. Because, Is she crying? Because you know, it's 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 so hard to trust people's words that keeps telling me that you have the best job in life. People want your position. People really people if if there are like people out there that got your positions right now. They are gonna be like so grateful and you just need to be grateful stop complaining stop feeling bad about yourself but i know i know that it may it, it might not be true you know every this single is, day I this wake is up literally the mindset of like people in the southeast asia almost all of the countries here just like people always just like trying to take like bring you down they never try to encourage you to do something that you want they always just like be be a normal person just be happy with your life like but i just don't believe that every single southeast asians can live happily as a normal person they want more sometimes people just want more but they never got the support they never got the encouragement they never got like the push at, on the back from people around Kyla just like she just mentioned everything that is so relatable for the most for the most of us I think uh, I do I did I I did really love my job back then I really worked hard for it too right I really love it but this is feels just not right so I took like a leap I guess and then I put everything into it I spent almost all of my savings like almost i don't know how many years of my office job savings for that and then i told myself this is your last chance if you if you fail you just need to accept the dv i tried so many times and then i set the debut date i i set it i put it no one knows about whatever that i'm doing and then and then two or three months before my actual debut i saw third gen audition i was like okay should i should i give it a chance i mean i'm so ready for my debut already i still have several ongoing commissions that is going on that time and then i was telling myself you know what, Kyla? Back then, when you saw the Holoro audition, you felt like you weren't ready for that. If you want to aim high, just go. You never know 
if whole life doesn't pick you up too it's okay you still you're gonna be a vtuber anyway right so it's like nothing to lose i guess yeah that's like a plan b yes so after that i still continue all of my commissions because i said a i i literally announced the the debut month right i i already said something like debuting on something something right so i still keep everything going and then after that i try to focus on the whole life auditions first and then i just i put all of the assets to that audition and somehow i made it <laughs> no i'm really happy that kyla took that step yeah long story if you... short i never debuted anyway <sighs> If Kyla didn't take that step... Stop crying, I'm working now. Go back to your work. You can't she debuted see in front of all of management. Her. I used all of the assets that like, I have. Like, Just saying, just saying. Kyla is one of the most hardworking um, VTuber in Hololife. One of. Not saying she's the most, but I gotta be honest, I'm not sure. But from what I see, she's one of the most hardworking ones. Especially on games. And pretty much game is just what people want to see. Really happy that Kyla took that step though. I put some of the emotes um, on the audition videos. I wrote my... What I did, okay. If you wanna know, um, I cannot really go into details, but I literally write my own story. So it's it's like storytelling. Um, I wrote my own story regarding my lore. My supposed to be VTuber debut lore. So the audition video is pretty much a lore video. It's still a bittersweet. It, it, it's a bittersweet memory because there is like a folder that I name it Gajadi Debut. <laughs> Gajadinya without space, right? Without space, without underscore, it's like GJD, small letters, and then in capital, debut. Masih ada, masih. Sometimes when life is so hard, when sometimes I feel like I'm giving up, when I feel like I cannot do it anymore, I gonna be like looking back at that folder and then I don't know, I just smile. I just smile and then I move on, like strengthen me other than my uh, family, right? The first one is that folder, the so funny folder, and then the other one is the the what the 365 elephers reforms that pomalo submit to me i still up until this day i still read that to strengthen me up yeah motivated so basically kyla here told you whenever you feel like giving up and whenever you don't get enough encouragement from other people first of all all you gotta do is be patient don't rush things because if you rush it, you won't. First of all, you won't be able to tell what is the outcome, and you won't even be able to guess it. And second of all, if you rush it, you're gonna give up way earlier before you succeed. So believe in yourself sometimes. You know.